Today's topic is scurvy, symptoms, causes, treatment, and prevention. Introduction. Also called Moller's disease, scurvy's is caused by inadequate levels of vitamin C in the body. The initial symptoms include weakness, tiredness, and tingling in the limbs. If left untreated, scurvy could be fatal. It's an uncommon disease and affects almost 6 to 8% of the population worldwide. A little bit about vitamin C. Asorbic acid, or vitamin C, is necessary for the body to absorb enough iron to make collagen. Vitamin C is a water-soluble vitamin, mostly present in citrus fruits and green vegetables. Also, this vitamin is necessary to repair damaged tissues, form bones, and produce neurotransmitters like dopamine and acetylcholine. Moreover, vitamin C also plays an important role in the metabolism of cholesterol in the body and wound healing. Signs and Symptoms Initial signs and symptoms Tiredness Weakness Numbness in arms and legs Irritation Bruising Myalgia or pain in the body Decrease in appetite, severe signs and symptoms, gingivitis or gum disease, iron deficiency, anemia, or lack of enough RBCs in the body, chest pain, shortness of breath, the inability of the body to combat infections, or an underactive immune system, hemorrhage or bleeding under the skin, hemorrhage in the white portion of the eye, bumpy chicken skin on arms and thighs, loss of teeth, confusion, Mood Swings If the disease is not treated timely, it can worsen and lead to death. Causes Insufficient levels of vitamin C in the body Abnormally fast metabolism of vitamin C in the body Inadequate intake of vitamin C Diagnosis After noticing scurvy's initial signs and symptoms, you should visit a doctor. He will diagnose the disease based on the physical exam and laboratory tests. Physical Examination the doctor can ask you some questions about your diet and the family history of this disease. He may observe the signs and can also do some blood tests to confirm scurvy. Laboratory tests. Blood tests. Most probably, the doctor may recommend blood tests to determine the levels of vitamin C in your body. People with serum levels of vitamin C below 11.5 micrograms per liter are suspected of having scurvy. Another purpose of these tests is to measure serum iron levels. Generally, a decrease in 50% of normal iron levels indicates the initial phase of scurvy. Imaging tests. Radiography is the most common imaging test for scurvy. Mostly, these tests serve to find out infection and internal damage caused by the disease. X-ray, also called differential diagnosis, is used to differentiate between scurvy and other related disorders, like rickets or osteomyelitis. Treatment. A deficiency of vitamin C causes scurvy. The treatment options include adequate intake of the vitamin. The sources of vitamin C include oral supplements, parenteral solutions, fruits and vegetables. The daily recommended dose of vitamin C is as follows. One to two grams per day for the first three days of the therapy. 500 milligrams for the next week. 100 milligrams for two to three months. Your doctor can increase or decrease the dose depending on the severity of your disease. Smokers and alcoholics are required to take an additional dose of 35 milligrams per day compared to non-smokers. Prevention of scurvy. The best way to prevent scurvy is to increase the vitamin C rich foods in your diet. It includes kiwi fruit, lychee, guava, cherry, lemon, orange, papaya, strawberry, parsley, broccoli, potatoes, liver, and whale skin. Caution! Vitamin C is a water-soluble vitamin. Cooking or seasoning the vegetables and fruits may affect their contents. It is recommended to take the food in raw form if possible. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.